Mega Steak Man. The blog. Hey there, Steak Cadets, and welcome to the Mega Steak Man. The blog. Number six, seven. I, it's been so long, I don't even know. Thank you for joining us. It has been a while, and that's why I figured I'd talk to you guys about what's going on in the world of Mega Steak Man. I've been pretty busy doing collaborations with Glue Studios. They're the guys who do a lot of the effects for College Humor. Uh, here's a few of the videos I worked on for Glue. I also worked with Mike Diva on uh, three videos, and uh, here's just two of them. The third one hasn't been released yet, but it's a, it's a doozy. <laughs> I also had the great privilege of being on the Forever Alone Filmmaking Podcast. It was a great episode. We talked about screenwriting for about two hours. Um, that's the podcast that's run by M. Strange, Jimmy Screamer Claus, and James Id. Uh, here's a link to that right now. It's worth it, I promise. It's funny. <laughs> I've been writing a lot of scripts. I have this one script, it's so funny. I don't know how I'm gonna do it. It's like about Link and he's like, but it's not really about Link, it's about the bad guys and it's like, they're, oh, oh, they're in a dungeon. It's good. It's Alicia Birnbaum of the Love Your Internet Show and Josh Reimer of Josh Reimer Comedies invited me out to do a speech for Viffy about Mega Steak Man on YouTube. So it's like a 17 minute talk about YouTube partnership and what to expect. Also how to grow your channel, which, if you followed my advice, ow. Oh, I also had neck surgery, which was a pain in the neck. That wasn't funny. The wheel of memes. So we spun the wheel and here's what happened. We have until next vlog to make a movie with Pokemon, Stargate, and Portal. We had the Portal gun though. We are going to make that video this weekend, I think. I just have to call it Lee. Uh, <laughs> speaking of Lee, we've been working on the Pokemon web series and that's going slow. I'm really, I'm, I'm strongly considering doing a Kickstarter for Pokemon, but I also don't want to get sued. Um, so it's kind of a gray area. Oh, the Virgin Radio Fake Film Festival. Thank you to all of you guys who voted for us and supported us in this endeavor. It was, it was close. We got second place. We lost by one point. Oh. I just got pocket dialed. Makes me mad. Don't pocket dial me, sucker. In other news, I'm thinking about going to VidCon. Let's talk a little bit about the Vic Taves video because that makes me angry for people who aren't in Canada and don't really know what's going on. Uh, this is kind of a movement that's happening everywhere is that there's these corporations and government entities or whatever that are trying to basically um, make the internet secure, which means tracking and monitoring everything, banking information, etc., and storing that in like vaults or whatever that um, supposedly hackers can't get into. <laughs> or something. Spending millions of dollars to make sure the infrastructure is there so they can just start spying on people without a warrant. So I made this video, um, spread it around if you want to stop this from happening either in Canada or locally. Stop Pippa, stop so... No. It's almost been a year since we started doing Mega Steak Man full time? in between my full time. I don't know, I've been trying to produce video content as much as possible, and I've seen amazing videos and amazing growth and uh, had some amazing conversations with friends on YouTube, so thank you very much. Um, our first video that was part of the official Mega Steak Man branding was Nerd Sex Tape, and that's our video of the week. What? Mega Steak Man product um, I don't remember how to do these videos anymore. So, so I guess in honor of that almost anniversary, here's Nerd Sex Tape again. That one I couldn't monetize because it was too sexy. Um, hey, thanks so much for watching this vlog, and stay subscribed, stay tuned for some Pokemon news and some really cool videos in April. I think you're gonna like them a lot. Thanks so much and take care, guys.